Hello again. Today I look at the game Robocop 2 for the Commodore 64 and 64GS. This was released on cartridge in 1990 and was a great little game, but very hard. The aforementioned Commodore 64GS, for anybody that doesn't know, was a failed attempt at a console by Commodore um, in approximately 1990. I think the intention was to send it up against the Nintendo, NES and Sega Master System. But the, uh, the problem was that they didn't actually build a new computer. What they did was they modified existing PCBs of Commodore 64s and stuffed them into a keyboardless shell. With no function keys, no keys at all. You just had your two joystick ports, a cartridge port and uh, Probably a good luck message from Commodore. There were games released on cartridge uh, from the days of the C64 that had you press F1 to start and uh, I think they were still on sale or were re-released for the, for the GS and I think you can see where the failure came from. Right, on with the game. Oh, you sneaky get. Come on. Fucking have you. Can't work out if this is Detroit or Glasgow. Fuck it. Jump. <clears throat> you twat. Oh, come on, start me straight from the bloody beginning. What's that W you do? Maybe it's a weapons upgrade. Fuck you, swonk. Can't get back up now. <laughs> this game kept me entertained for many hours. I could just never do it. Right now, jump. Look at these intermission screens. God, I remember this. There's friendly and foe, and you have to...
fucking player. I bet Call of Duty players would have trouble with this. Oh, you twat. I shot you. Can't shoot no more. Watch it tell me I've not done good enough in the firing range. <laughs> well, thank you very much. Oh. Hmm. Not sure if I helped him or killed him. Spangle. Ah, oh, yeah, fucker. It's very critical, you know. It's, it's the pixel perfect. The trouble is, the sprite collision on the C64 isn't always pixel perfect. In fact, it never is. of Monty on the run where the uh, big tube thing comes down and splats you. Yo fuck back. Ah. Knackers. Well it's hard. Thank you for watching. Take care until next time. Bye bye.